Hi, I'm Madison and I'm from Golden, Colorado and I met Eric at Earth Treks when he was filming a video with Will, who is my coach, which is super dope. And I'm gonna be climbing on this multicolored 7C over here. I haven't tried yet, so we'll see how it goes. <laughs> So I think I hit the hold on top of the volume a little too far left, so I, and then I dry fired a little bit and slipped, so I think just a little bit more accuracy and it'll go better. Yeah, I think I didn't have my feet in the right place. I think if I move them and then try and go more as a dead point to it, it'll go well. Yeah, and then I can hike my foot up and dead point to the next one too. I'm 16 years old and I've been climbing for three years, almost four. Yeah, I started climbing at Earth Treks and I joined the Earth Treks team like two months after it opened and that was kind of the first experience I had with climbing other than just like at the rec center, which was not a very good climbing gym or introduction to climbing but it's been great. <laughs> you ready? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Getting closer and closer. Yeah, one move every time. If I lock in more with my left arm, then it'll stabilize me more to dead point and like give me the time to stick the hold. So I think that might be good. I think I'm gonna try it from the middle to try and do the top section in one go and then piece it together. I think the dead point with the high foot is going to be the hardest move to do from the start just because it takes a lot of like suck. <laughs> nice, come on. Come on, Maddie. Yep, 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 easy. <gasps> Come on. <It's> the top. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was gonna slip. <laughs> yeah, just like just gotta slow down, breathe, and then do it. So what's next then? There's another 7C on this wall that Nick and just made it look super fun, so I'll try that. Not sure how it'll how it'll go. It's slopers, not very good at that much better with just like bearing down and some gnarly crimps but it'll be good to work on something I'm not good at. You might want to go with the match for the next hold. It's exactly like as soon as you kind of pop out, yeah. the hold is terrible. Mm. So I just be focused on just like locking it in as much with the back as you can. And then you're like, oh, like it's not actually that far of a move. Yeah, get as high up as you can on it before you have to move off of it. Exactly. Nice, Matty. Come on, Matty. I think if I pull higher up on it, I'll be able to hold the cut. But if I throw a foot on the higher up hold, might be able to like go out and then keep it. 
I kind of catch myself with it. <sighs> falling out a lot so I think I either need to go more statically or find something to catch like a heel hook on that hold to hold me in so I don't know. I'll probably try going more statically first and see how that goes if I get closer or if the heel is gonna feel really good so let's see gonna give it a go <laughs> That's like a deep look, dude. Yeah, that was sweet. <laughs> sweet. <laughs> yeah, the setting here is super cool. I really like it. It's a lot different, and the movement and the holds, it's all super good. So I'm gonna try this purple 60, because it looks super crimpy and fun, and it has a cool one-two move. I just kind of dry fired and slipped off of this hand as I was going for the cross. <laughs> so I'll have to try that again. <laughs> to go all at once and really glide through it. <laughs> That's it for today. I had a lot of fun climbing with Eric and Nick and sneaked in a little bit. And if you guys want, you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Laddie Marson or Lady Marson, I guess it looks like. See you guys later. Nice.